Idaho Heroes gameplay. So today we're going to look at the new events that just dropped right now, which uh, Gray Dwarf's Blessing is still continuing. So if you got some gear you want to upgrade, it's for a truckload of gold. But I hear later in the game that gold is not too important. Big thing is the gems. Uh, Forest Treasure Pack is out, which for 20 bucks you can get 10 of your profit orbs. You can get 15 of your heroic summon scrolls, 45 million, which is a ton of gold right now. As you can see, I got 4 million, but that goes really quick. Uh, value packs, as always, Profit Orb, because right now is the middle of the Profit Orb event. So we're going to go ahead and do some summons at the end of the video. I have been saving all of my Profit Orbs, all of my Heroic Scrolls. So I believe we have 30, so we'll be able to get at least one or two five-star heroes, because with that, Heroic Miracle is here as well. So I've been kind of waiting. Um... I saved all my heroic scrolls as well, just waiting for that event, but we are back to the profit event. So let's go ahead and knock out a couple summons. Hopefully I can get somebody good, and we're going to be focusing on the abyss. So we're going to do a couple summons here, and I do have 39 orbs, so I'll wait till I get another one tonight. And here, nothing too good. A couple more four stars, which is good, and uh, some more shards towards another five star hoping we get somebody rare which there is fat moo and baria haven't used either of those and then we did get some more five star shards so it looks like we're going to be able to summon a couple one a couple more but that did give us enough to get our first summoning points and our second summoning points so we'll take a look at those really quick and make sure you're not using any of the profit orbs or any of the heroic scrolls outside of the events Always save them. So we have one more summons, which not sure we'll go for the uh, the forest as well. That's another one that we've been working on. And a five star Thale. That's actually pretty nice. I know I do need them to upgrade a couple other ones. So unfortunately, not much there. So I'm going to wait till tonight to do my last summons. Did get significant amount of the uh, ability to replace my hero which I've been doing with a couple. I think that's how I'm gonna to try to complete the event itself is the Prophet's Blessing. So I can actually go through and get a couple five-star heroes out of there, just leveling them up in here. The only thing that I'm missing is the dark and the light. Um, haven't Don't have any five-star light or any five-star dark heroes as of right now. So we'll continue to focus on those. Oh, I think I actually went to Twitter accidentally. Collecting some of our rewards here. Uh, see free heroes. So making sure again, saving the profit orbs till the event. It looks like here we do have a couple five stars that we can get. The ones that we just got was Thale, uh, Bera, uh, Fat Mushu, and it looks like we do have some summoning shards as well. So definitely worth saving them for the profit orb because we do get free characters with it and all the shards you get and all the rewards too so looks like actually went going to twitter didn't go to twitter but still got the uh, reward for it so i'm going to save up the rest of my profit orbs hopefully i can finish the profit or sub an event and then also the heroic miracle as we continue but if you look at all the ones that you would have lost without saving your orbs you would have lost the shards uh, you would have lost some characters and hopefully i can get down to the abysmal the chronos is the one that I'm really looking for. So click the subscribe button, turn on the notifications so you can stay up to date on the videos, and thank you guys for watching.